when I want to alter my spool valves is launch the uh, the tractor launch pad I can tap on my uh, my spool valve options there and then I can see all the uh, spool valves I've got available uh, to me and I can then touch on uh, each one of those to, uh, to to change any of the uh, of the values if I want to uh, alter the uh, the flow on there is just touch and uh, drag the uh, the bar across the uh, across the screen but then if uh, I can use my rotary dial as well so I can highlight uh, put a uh, highlight the blue box and then I can use my dial then to uh, increase or decrease the uh, the flow rate on that uh, that spool I can also set a timer on there so I can activate my timer again I can uh, use the uh, sliding bar to uh, set a time or again use my uh, my rotary dial to uh, to set a, a, a you know very fine uh, time on this uh, on this spool valve and then I can confirm that uh, that uh, is now uh, that's now set so as soon as then I touch on my uh, on my red spool then is I'll now activate that uh, that two second timer on the uh, on that spool and as we can see as soon as I touch the uh, the uh, the control then for that red spool it kicks in that timer if I want to be able to uh, have a bit of fine tuning of my valve without the timer kicking in straight away is I press on the uh, on the gear wheel and I can activate this uh, this function here if I go back to my uh, my valve then is I now have this, uh, this this button here and it gives me three options so the top option then will be as soon as I touch the valve control it will activate the timer but will allow me to put it into uh, into float middle option here then allows me proportional control over my valve but then if I click the uh, control lever either all the way forwards or all the way down it again will it will activate the timer and then the third option then I've got proportional control if I click it all the way down I'll activate the timer or if I click it all the way up it will uh, put the uh, put the valve into uh, into float so if I select the uh, the middle one is I've now got proportional control over the uh, over the valve and as soon as I let go is uh, it's stopping but then if I click it uh, all the way forwards it now has activated my two second timer or if I click it all the way down it activates that uh, that two second timer in the third option as I said before then is we've still got proportional control but if I click it all the way up I've now gone into uh, into float on that valve but uh, then if I click it all the way down it activates then the uh, the two second uh, the two second timer as well